Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to Field Trips. We are still here with this ragtag bunch. Oliver and I, Big Bass Dreams. You guys know this guy. <laughs> Wes and Maddie, they're not waiting for us. They're already going down in the fly craft. Yeah, going down. You're going down. Do another little competition today. So last time we were on Table Rock Lake. Before that, we were here on the James River. We're doing a different stretch today. A little competition. We need, what are the rules? Big fish, first fish. What? Do a little competition today. Super organized as you can tell, but yeah, been up since 3 a.m. Just not getting woken up, but we're doing a longer flow today. Probably about eight hours. So yeah, we're gonna get after it. Sun just came up. Oliver, you ready to do it? Let's do it, man. Let's we try to... It doesn't count. We gonna win? Oh, I mean, come on, what do you guys think? Yeah, <laughs> definitely. Them winning the first round is still debatable, I would say. Yeah, that's definitely up for interpretation. All right, see you guys in the water. Man, I just love these rock formations. Beautiful. <laughs> Look at this sign. Paddle faster, I hear banjos. <laughs> Maddie's doing it right, man. I don't know how you line this up so well. Got that charm, you know? Yeah, that might be it. All right, go ahead and start my trip in the Angler app. If you don't know the Angler app, that's what this thing on my hat is for. But basically, it helps you create like a fishing log book. You mark everywhere you find structure, everywhere you catch a fish, and then it overlays all kinds of data on that. And basically, you can go back and look, and every time I caught fish, the wind was out of the east, or what the cloud coverage was doing, or what the barometric pressure was doing all that sort of thing. You could put all that together and really dial in some patterns that otherwise you would not notice. All right, just started the trip. Let's see if we can't find some fish. Beautiful. I just can't help but smile like a freaking corny This is a rad river, man. I like it here. Yeah, this is cool. This is new for me. Yeah, a little different than blasting across Table Rock at 65 miles an hour. Yeah, a little different. A little different than here than, than it was at Party Cove. I'm hoping we find a little party slew or something. I feel like the party slew may not be full of Shelby's here. It may be full of something else. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We should have invited Shelby here on the river, man. Yeah. That would have been a good first date, or I guess second date, technically. It could be. Shelby, man, the one that got away. Oh, she didn't get away, though. That's true. She didn't get away. Oh, here we go. First blood. Nice. On the Z crank. Hey, little small smalls. Smally smalls. Oh, he's got friends. What am I gonna do? Check this out. I'm gonna try and double up. Like, get my life together. Oh no. Oliver's got his first fish of the day on. He's got a follow and now he's He's trying to double up right here, going for style points. Oh gosh, doubled up on myself. Going for style points, double fisting. Where'd your friend go? I wasn't quick enough on the draw. But I got my mans here. Nice. Nice little river smolly on the crank. Something about throwing a craw colored crank for smallmouth. Just feels right. It's just something that I've watched guys, legends like Al Lidner doing. Right. As a youngster. And really, we don't have a lot of clear water, let alone uh, river systems where I'm from, just outside of LA. Never had the opportunity to experience like things like this. Right. Catching river smallmouth on a craw colored crankbait, man. Little homie. Thanks, bro. That's the best part about traveling, man. New things, new techniques. Yeah, absolutely. I don't know if you guys ever seen our river, the LA River. Different than this? The brown trout aren't as pretty. Oh, back to back. Oh, nice. oh, it came off. Oh, you spit it? Oh, I blew it. Man, they were liking that crank the other day. This is a new crank. Oh, is it? Yeah. S uh, same color. Oh, my goodness. We found the hole, bro. Well, you want to. Oh, wanna... my goodness. Wow, you spit it again? Bro, that's three, three casts back to back to back. So that one didn't count. Oliver found that honey hole. Oh. Found a little little pocket. You got another? Oh, he's on it! He's on it! Get it! Get it! The fi 
figure eight. The figure eight. Come on. Where'd you go? What was that? Man, you really did find a little hole right there. Yeah. That was dope. I wonder what's I wonder what's going on in there that they're liking. We need to... I don't know, but we should definitely fish this hole a little bit longer. Yeah, yeah. Oh, dude, I'm not kidding. Like they are stacked in here. Dude, just cast. <laughs> oh, dude, they're coming up in groves, like groves, bro. Oh, dude, I'm serious. Oliver's got another one on right here. I just put my camera away. Next cast, he got a fourth fish out of this one little spot. On and he said cast. that there's more around it too. He's double fisting again. I'm about to throw up in there. See if we can't double up here this morning. That's weird, man. Something's going Bro, on right there. That they're in here. They're liking. All right. Fish. Forget the float, man. We could go back from here. We'll just meet the guys at the... Yeah, just have them pick us up. Like, sorry, y'all. We fished the same hole for eight hours. Like, I, ain't, I, don't, I don't need to go anywhere. Caught 74 fish. <laughs> All right, so that's two landed. We don't need to cheat. They are smacking the Z2 crank. Not, not a giant, obviously, but... Really Man, cool. I'm about to put on a craw color crank because that'd be a prudent move. I'm running this through the honey hole and they're not hitting it. Oh. <laughs> no, seven casts in a row wasn't wasn't gonna. <laughs> now you're upset. It wasn't in the cards. Yeah, only only six bites in a row. All right, well, I'm gonna let you have that honey hole. They ain't, they ain't picking up what I'm putting down. Need a Maybe, man. I'll, I'll throw this a few more times, but or actually, I mean, I mean, bro. Why don't I? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, I'm sold on the mega bass stuff, man. It's been working everywhere we've been going. It's a real thing. It's a real thing. You're like, hey, man, you got any more of that mega bass? <laughs> a little dark craw. They should eat that. I like it. They'll still see that orange flash. This is a flap slap. This is what I was catching them on yesterday. Flap slap. Yes, sir. Don't click Don't the hashtag. Don't click the hashtag. Yeah. Good morning, Courtney. Bro, you, you on Tinder over there? Where you? Uh, yeah, you don't follow Courtney Smith? Sportswoman Courtney? No, ma'am. I mean, sir. All right. Well, this thing did give me my first bite. I mean, kind of like Oliver was just talking about. You would think, okay, we'll stick with that, but. Uh-oh. When yeah, homies over boy. here getting. When oh, they're on them. Are you on? No. Would that be a bad thing? When your boy over here is like on his eighth fish and ten casts, this may not be broke, but I'm gonna I'm gonna switch it out anyways. Oh, he's coming around the yak. We may really not need to leave, bro. Got me a little Missouri rooster fish. Missouri rooster fish. Look at this guy. What is this? Oh, oh. You going for a Missouri sleigh ride? Good morning. Is it a good fish? Howdy doody! Oh yeah dude, much better fish, nice. The crankbait bite it. is on this morning. Well folks, we appear to have a bit of a traffic jam up here on the river. The worst account, I'm imagining like a hippo, like one of these things charging me. Top of the morning ladies. How you doing? Everyone's trying to cool off today. There are a couple calves with them. I wouldn't get too close. This is a viral video in the making when one of these things attacks Oliver. There we go. Hey! Get him raw. Feels decent. It's no monster, but... God, they're so strong, man. Like, they're never as big as I think they're gonna be. This is a, uh, I wasn't getting bit on the flap slap, so I switched to that other one. What's it called? D2. Got it done. That was maybe my fourth cast with it. Nice. Go ahead and ding that guy in the angler app. This little guy, again, they're just so strong. They're, it's misleading. Every time they come up, I'm like, that's, that's it. That's, that's what was just working me.
Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Oh! Ah! Uh -huh. Larry, good morning. All right, y'all. Well, I'm not positive this is Big Bass of the Day so far, but I think it's probably, probably right there. You think yours was bigger? Damn it! Come on, baby. Stay on. Oh, through the grass. Oh. Oh no. Oh, we're good. Hey! What's up? What's up? Look at that guy. Got a little bass and salad here on the blade. Craw colored spinner bait. Fish number 12. Uh, too much fun. Class 18 method. <laughs> Another little baby. That's number four. Tiny guys. Where are the big girls at? The mighty rock bass. How early in the season. Well, that's not a rock bass. Another smallie. Number six. There's no size to them still. There's bigger ones in here. Just gotta keep keep at it. It's not huge, but it's not a rock bass. I'd say that it's gonna be a giant, giant rock bass. The second I started reeling it. Man, I just can't weed through all these little guys. There's another one, number seven. Ding that guy in the angler app. Beautiful, beautiful fish. Whoop. It's just such a textbook spot. Nice little tree coming out, causing a little current break, and then a rocky shelf right behind it. Decent current going by it. Ah, bro. Why did we get sucked out it like this? <laughs> no, no. There we go. I got one too. Oh gosh. Oh no. Ow. I just got that hook out of him and straight into me. Another little guy. Wow. That was with some gusto, bro. It's my middle name, homie. Robert Gusto Field. That's not true, it's, it's Joseph. <laughs> there we go, there we go. Watched him come out and smack it. Oh, pretty one too. Nice. Field tripping, baby. Beauty. Whew, look at the colors on that girl. That is a good looking fish. See you, girl. Fun to watch. Oh, God. Spinner bait bite is still on. Got tied up in the stringer of goggle eye. Look at the damn rock bass stringer. <laughs> Sabotage me. These guys are about to get smoked later on. Yeah, we got dinner going, boys. Oh, yeah. Okay. Nice fish, man. Thanks, bud. Beauty. Sweet. Beautiful, and the fish is cute, too. Oh, stop. <laughs> well, we can go back to catch it big. <laughs> Bro, a monster just swiped at my swim bait a foot like as I was pulling it out of the water. Dude, that fish had a pound on the one I just caught. Easy. Dang. <laughs> She must have come out of there. Oh, goodness gracious, that was a good fish. Big girls seem to be turning on right now. Oh my God, the puppies are fine. Oh, this would be great. Might be the last time I see a pretty girl with all their teeth for like two months, so I'm gonna take it. <laughs> all in big 
figure that out and I'm gonna just head out and fish right now. Um, yeah, we're floating until about two or three o'clock it looks like. And then we're just gonna kind of chill. So you're more than welcome okay. to come hang out. We can maybe grab a couple drinks, catch up, and then plan on a plan. We can, eat, I mean, we'll be back early enough to where if we want to, we can go out tonight. That sounds amazing. Yeah, oh my God, every cast. <laughs> I'm so jealous of you right now. I've I got to go. another. I got to put this boat in the water. <laughs> I've got another nice small mouth on the crankbait. Like this river kayak thing is so new to me. Like this is, oh my God, there's a bigger one with it. Okay, look, I'm gonna try and cheat and double up here. Wait, what do you mean double up? So there's a follower on my fish and it's bigger than the one I've got hooked. So I'm, Do you think you can hook the bigger fish with the fish you have hooked? No, uh, no, that happens once in a while, but I'm actually taking my second rod with this oh, little gotcha, swim gotcha, bait gotcha, on it gotcha, and like gotcha. dragging it around my fish. Yeah. Oh, uh, yeah, you got to get up here. They're going. Yeah, sounds like it. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, just plan on coming up this afternoon then and then I'll, okay. I'll verify and uh, we'll get a little cameo from my friend sportswoman Courtney. You guys oh want my God. You guys want to see so that? I'm excited about fishing. Yeah, well, that's why I want to hang out with you. You, you got the passion. I have the passion. I just need the fish and I need the buddies. Like I haven't <laughs> found a crew here. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, does that make sense? It does. Yeah. Home, homie, I travel alone most of the year, so let's plan on that, and I'll catch up with you um, when we pull out to like take a little break or something. Okay, that sounds good. Okay. okay. All right. Fish Bye. Oh yeah, dude. Better one. Better fish. Oh, get out of there. Get out of there. Uh, you had it. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. No, 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 no. Oh, watch her. Watch her come out and smoke it too. Oh, what a juicy laydown. There's got to be more in there. That was my first real good cast up in there. There we go, guys. Ding that guy. In the angle wrap. This V9 Mega Bass spinner bait just hits different as the kids say oh, dude, I just got by my baby. I was up in the tree again. <laughs> action is on fire y'all i can't seem to weed through the small ones there's finally pretty decent fish right here gosh they're just so fun though they're so strong and i snagged that girl she was all up in that trying to trying to shake me off get me hung up luckily i was able to muscle her out beautiful Beautiful fish. Hee nice. See ya, girl. Well, y'all, it is very obviously a weekend out here. There, it is a zoo out here on the river right now. There are a million people floating, drinking, recreating. Uh, I mean, they're bumping it into us. It's just kind of a madhouse. So we're actually gonna cut this shorter than we planned. This is basically a takeout of, we're about halfway down and uh, Essentially, Wes's wife is going to come pick us up here. It's just hard to fish, and there's a billion people out here. Coming here on a weekend was a bad idea, obviously. Wes says he's never seen it this busy, but I mean, look at this. There's like 500 people just right here at this bend. So we're going to call it. Super fun day. We caught a ton of fish. We don't see any reason to keep fighting these crowds. Kind of takes away from the, the ambiance, the magic of these little kayak river adventures when there's 5,000 people all around you. Look at this haul. We got a feast, boys. <laughs> we do. Well, we got white bass. Oh, that's right. We do have the white bass. All that stuff, too. Dude, Forgot about that. I won't tell anybody that. We are just undebatably the victors, Oliver and I. Really, Oliver. I was just, I was just enough non-dead weight to, to help us edge out these other guys. 36 fish to 24, 25. Two different boats. Y'all picked the teams. I didn't pick the teams. I didn't pick the teams. <laughs> I didn't have nobody rowing me. Yeah, he could have used that excuse before you lost. Yeah. Doesn't work now. <laughs> mm. Mm. I feel Man. like I'm still a winner. Like? It's a trend here. Still a winner. Right. In my own eyes. Yeah. We're all it. we're Enjoy all winners, it. bud. We're all winners. Yeah, enjoyed it thoroughly. That's cool. Stop it. That's just funny. Yeah. That was very anticlimactic. Well, I mean. I'm mostly just worried that if the dogs won't eat it, <laughs> should we be? 
All right, you guys, we got a little plot twist going on right now. We came out to the James River to fish for smallmouth, but the star of the show has become these goggle eyes, googly eyes, as, as googly Oliver eye. calls them, these rock bass. I've never... No, no, no. The mighty... <laughs> the mighty... Rock bass. Don't get it twisted. Rock bass, I beg your pardon. So I've never even heard of anyone eating these fish. Weston assures us that they're delicious, so we're about to fillet these guys up and we're gonna cook them up along with the white bass that Oliver and I caught when we smoked these guys on Table Rock Lake. Absolutely annihilated them. So we're gonna cook them up the same way and we're gonna do a little taste comparison. See what, see what we think. I don't know, these rock, I'm super skeptical. I've never these rock eaten bass. one. We'll see what happens. I've, and I've eaten a lot I've of never heard of a single person eating one. No. And I like, I've heard of people eating like every fish that I'm like, I wouldn't eat that. We'll, we're gonna even, see. I've never Jury's seen definitely these out. Things. Yeah, we, yeah. They don't, we don't have these on the West Coast. Yeah. Right. Never seen these. Never even caught them. These SoCal so. boys, they don't even know what we're talking I about them, right uh, now. We're I'm figure eighting them. <laughs> you are figure eighting <laughs> your clothes. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I only caught two and they were both small and I let them go. Well, we Oliver was on them today. We should be able to fit all these massive slabs. <laughs> yeah. All these massive he grabbed a bowl guys. as big as my torso I'm like, used to for these like, four <laughs> rock bass. I'm like, what, what are you doing with that? You got, you got fish in the truck I don't know about? <laughs> yeah, like, We're going to see, you guys. I don't know. Yeah, this uh, this yeah. might go either way. We'll see. See. Oliver, if, if you're... He's a team player. How are you still surprised that you're putting the team on your back, man? Like, at this point, I'm it's, saying, it's I'm been the... I'm disappointed. Like, this is pretty pathetic. I caught... Probably two, I don't even know what a keeper is, but it was they were both before they told us to keep them. Look at these majestic creatures. Yeah, majestic. That's that's a word so for them. Have a, a size preference. Know, this is like... this is the most pathetic. <laughs> that is the most pathetic. Fish. Oh, I've never had a catch and cook where the stringer was like just that. That's that's it. That's it. Wow. <laughs> It's like the a, mighty, the mighty rock bass. I mean, if you use your imagination, it's kind of like a micro <laughs> Goliath grouper. Yeah. yeah or I'm pretty sure Goliath groupers come out the womb bigger than that, bro. That one's pooping. Sweet. That one's pooping after death. Yep. Well, little rigor mortis poop. I pooped on the river today. I'm glad I got the. Oh, yes, you, you did. did. <laughs> yes, you did. <laughs> right. I warned y'all though at breakfast that I was gonna poop on the river, so. Like, well, you were successful, so congrats. I was a gentleman, I warned you guys. Do you guys feel like uh, This is the thumbnail, hold it out a little farther. Could you hide your whole hand and body in the house? Yeah. So they can't tell <laughs> how the tiny. Whole background. Yeah, is there any way you could hide the earth so they can't tell how small this fish is? <laughs> Going bad? Courtney's hating. What, what, Courtney is hating. She's what? like, I drove from like, Fayetteville for know. this. <laughs> for this rock I'm just bass. Just steak. Just a little rusty, <laughs> right, Holly? You brought the steaks. I brought the steaks. Super clutch. Thank you. I'm like, <laughs> you know, you. we're having this big fish fry. <laughs> big fish fry. What there it is. This is the fish fry. fry. <laughs> uh oh, he's going. I sold her on it. Oh, oh awesome. dude. Oh, lost the googly eye, eye. dude. We lost the googly eye. I wish it's I had my precious play cargo, fish. man. Relax. I wish I had my. Look how thin that is. Bats. Yeah. So, j thank you for bringing steaks, or I'd be going. I'd be ordering pizzas. Oh, we got so, some white bass from the other day. Yeah, we do have yeah, some white bass. We do have some white bass. Thanks to all of our meat. Dude, we're, we're <laughs> the only ones that tell them, we're bro. the only ones that brought any fish tell back. Them, bro. Tell them. <laughs> we're the only one, we're, what are y'all eating for dinner? That's Someday. what I want to know. <laughs> My buddy once told me that not every day is your day. And you That's can't, true. That, you know, you got to remember that. But he sounds like a loser. <laughs> That's true. But you know what I mean? Like, That's true. That are better. Don't name and drop your buddy then. Man. Wow. Slabs. All right, guys. Pro tip. Survival situation. You need to catch about 79 rock bass to feed your family. We caught like 10. That's gotta, solid. I mean, we did catch like a dozen. We just decided to keep them at the at, very at tail end. At 1 o'clock, yeah. So like, yep. That's pretty good. Hey, look. Man, clean as a whistle, bro. Let's, let, right? let's try and see what the other side will turn out. I really don't know what you're trying to insinuate because I'm pretty deadly with this. <laughs> I look that way. Ready for the hack job. Hack job? You mean like you last night on the white bass? Ooh. Shots fired. Ooh. <laughs> Hawaii. I don't know, man. You guys want to claim this guy? Wow. Because <laughs> SoCal, we get down with the fish cleaning. Yikes. Watch me play my hand. Watch me play in my hand. Flaying a raw bass is just like a mahi, man. Everyone knows that. Yeah, it's just. <laughs> That's how you know you got a keeper. <laughs> oh, I didn't boy. actually oh, didn't hear a thing. I don't yeah, think there was any. Where's yeah. the 120 on that? Oof. Oh boy. 
<laughs> yeah, right? It's like a fillet, only smaller. You know, I bet you though these things are gonna come out pretty good. I mean, every sunfish species for the most part these is are a good, good eating man. fish. It is true. Any fish like this is typically not worth the effort, but if you put the effort in, they're good. It's I mean, if you're that bored. <laughs> if you're that bored. If you're that desperate for some YouTube content. There is oil in you. <laughs> Bro, I was already super skeptical of the, the harvest. Hey, dude, it's fine. It's fine. It's a little clean up. <laughs> a little clean up. If that one scares you, we got this one. We got a snort. We got, we a, got snorter. a snorter. We got a snort. So then look, this one comes with the, you know, Courtney seems unconvinced, I would say. <laughs> I mean, is a, this is going to be a you great first experience. <laughs> yeah, welcome to Missouri. Personally, I don't think it's that. You know. I kind of like the dual handles, you know, like you can separate, you know, the mass quantity of googly eye we have. Right, from the crawfish. From the crawfish. Just wipe down the top. I think Oliver said it best. It's like a cast iron skillet. It's got, yeah. it's got seasoning. That one has a power cord sitting on it, which I think probably works for either. So there's a whole lot of I thinking going on here. So let's, yeah. Not a whole lot of I knowing. Luckily, Courtney brought steaks, so we might not starve tonight. <laughs> Thanks for that. You're awesome. Got Bree here who rescued us from the river today. Hello, yes I did. Yeah. So we had this big plan to do this whole float, and then we ran into like the zoo of Missouri drunk locals and just decided this is not the vibe we're looking for, and luckily, Wesson called uh, Bree and, and she came and, and rescued us at like an impromptu right. takeout. Yeah, she drove out, picked us up. I had to ride in the trunk, but the way I smelled, hey, I'm surprised gross. she didn't make me get on the roof, honestly. And Brooks was sound asleep and with the smell you didn't wake him up. You know what's so funny is that <laughs> you were like, Brooks is in the car. And, and you totally didn't even know And then I was, like, I was like, I don't know what she meant, but there's no one in this car. I, I like did not know he was in there. I had no idea. No, I, I was positive there were two empty car seats in that in that car. No, no, but were you in there, weren't you, Bubba? Yeah. Hey, buddy. Hey. Hi. You're now YouTube famous. Yay! You look unimpressed. And He's I don't like, blame you. I, 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 <laughs> I don't blame you. It's like, get me out. Right? We're gonna just pour on top of the uh, two year old oil, but we're gonna clean the baskets. I like the two year old oil. I'm down with that. We, could, we should probably. Ca probably no, nah, oil takes on season. Oil, you can you can have oil with some some you, soul. That's a thing. Old, you ask those old heads, those old crappie guys, they're like, I won't ever change my oil. I haven't changed my oil since 1967. 100%. 100%. Come help me talk to him in Probably, I don't believe probably it. Probably clean the roach. Oh, you're, oh, you're being serious. Probably, yeah. probably clean the roach carcasses off well, the baskets, well, but the oil. The same well, I said I was going to try it. I'm sensing some skepticism over here. I'm going to try it too, but I'd rather try it with not two-year-old. I'm telling you, oil gets better with age. That's a real thing. Now these nasty baskets, I don't know about. Hey, hey. <laughs> What's going on? Here? We think. I mean, this is just you gotta, cosmetic, you so that's not out. getting cleaned. I mean, I mean we could just good. clean it for the. Uh, I'll terrible. clean it for the tube, just so people don't think we're like. I don't yeah. want the health organization I'm, I'm after us or something. This is. I'm surf. <laughs> Y'all are surf. You're just. You guys are surf. I'm you got the stakes. So I'm but, sorry about the way the. Surf that's fair enough. Well, I mean, Oliver. You, Oliver and I caught them all, so I guess that's I, fair. Yeah, I mean, so I cleaned them. Good luck. <laughs> that's true. I, mean, it says it's I said, uh, you like how I, I just I piggybacked off the Oliver and I caught them all? I caught the one white bass. You did. The but big that, one but big, the big white I bass. Big yeah, yeah, yeah. I appreciate you. I appreciate you. Oh, that looks Dude, good. Bro. My man. And Dude, it's on the cage. Oh, man. <laughs> bro, I had not seen that till I got home. All right, you guys. So Oliver cleaned the fish. He also just cleaned the fryer. Well, I cleaned a fryer. It turned out it was the wrong fryer because we didn't have a cord for it. We got the fryers cleaned. The turf is like done, so we're, we're on a time crunch now, but we got this white bass already cleaned up. Bam! Actually, decent amount, dude, for three white bass. That's a decent haul right there. And then we got ah. <laughs> all this rock bass. Invite the neighbors. It's gonna be good, though. Dude. It's gonna be good. We're using peanut oil, which is my go-to, and I didn't even pick that. That is a... Uh... It's always important when you're frying fish that to use an oil that has a high burn rate. Totally. 
if you try to do this with olive oil, you're going to be surprised. Right. Not in a good way. <laughs> Not a good surprise. I'm actually really excited to try these guys I, out. I really am you too. Know? I love trying new fish. I know. It's going to be a new species. It's going to be good. Gonna be yeah. I'm positive. I can just look at the flays. I know it's going to be good. It's going to be a very short and quick good, like a one <laughs> bite kind of good, but it's going to be a good bite. Either I'm way, excited. it's going to be delicious. I'm excited. And I know the white bass are going to be good. That, that's the one nice thing is we get the fallback of these white bass. They're, they're delicious. I was just cooking over in Oklahoma a week ago. Well, hey, option number two. This was on. Option number two? And yeah. Jamama? The Louisiana. Who am I to heard of the party? You know, like the fish fry stuff is cool, but... I'm not a huge fan of it. You, you make up a little pancake mix. Are you serious right now? I'm dead serious. Yeah, that's something I'll do. So you making pancakes or you making fish? Bro, blueberry. Make it both. That's not blueberry. Tell me that's not blueberry. Okay, okay. I was like, hold up. Now, okay. now you just lost me. You just lost me. The blueberry rock bass pancakes. A little winter lager here in the summer. <laughs> Ooh, yeah, wow. We're just doing it, doing it right. And uh, I should have gone the other way and put the flour into the beer. But uh, you want me to hold that bowl? Yeah, that'd be great. This, yeah. I thought maybe oh. it was like a trick you knew. It was kind of cool. Like it was fun. It was working out. So yeah, if you actually put the flour into the beer, you're not gonna get clumps like I'm getting now. So I'm like frantically. You gotta to whisk it, whisk it harder. Yeah. Whisk it, bro. Whisk it for the biscuit. You know what I'm saying? Whisk it for the biscuits. <laughs> All right, y'all, this, if you were ever in doubt that my catching cooks are totally improv and that no recipes are involved, here it is. Apparently now we're pancaking some of this fish. I don't even know what's happening. Jemima and Sam. Oh, and Jemima. You can't go wrong with Aunt Jemima. That's a but, marriage. Y'all, I don't even know what's going to happen next. Your guess is as good as mine. Now we got pancakes involved. I don't even know what's happening. I don't even know what's happening. I prefer Bisquick, but we don't have that, so it's cool. Uh, this thing was turning on before. Oh, oh my God. God. <laughs> did I just hear that right? I did not hear that. Are we grilling this fish? <laughs> yeah, so... Never what you want to hear from this, the second fryer attempt. Oh, I heard a bing! No, the bing is not necessarily a good thing. See, I'm like putting on max because we had a light earlier. We no longer have this light, so... Uh... Steak it is, folks! Never mind! <laughs> that was a short-lived fish fry. <laughs> Catch and try to cook. So a new hashtag. I, cook on the skillet. Miss Courtney, can I could pan fry them in a pan. I was gonna say pan on the, fry. Just on the stove. You tell me we got one fryer that works with no cord and one fryer with with a cord, cord that doesn't, doesn't work. work. No, but the thing is, we're gonna field trips, y'all. We're field tripping right now. <laughs> tripping. Um, What's happening? No, we had it. Just make me nervous. Let me just check this. It's really close. We is we, this open? Closer. Um, <laughs> oh wow. We uh. We had it on earlier, but I don't know what's going on now because this is uh, it's not. Can you flip a breaker? <laughs> what's going on, it's dude? It's weird enough. What's oh, going no. on, dude? <laughs> <laughs> Come on. Plan B is not panning out the way we saw it going. Long story short, scrap all this. I'm sorry all this even happened. We're gonna fry these up in the rig in the Keystone Cougar back home tomorrow and then we're going fishing with oliver courtney you coming yes courtney's coming you coming I mean, maddie's acting like he's got bigger better plans i know that's not i'm true. gonna go float he again he does have bigger fish to fry ah, uh, <laughs> bigger fish to fry because we got they're tiny they're tiny fish y'all okay um yeah scrap all this you're about to like magically appear at my rv time warp Poof. I, I should come up with some kind of, you know, like kids, like, like they're like, Pop! they do like, like the whole thing. <laughs> wait, wait, how? Horrible suggestion. That's, <laughs> that's how? how. The Scooby-Doo. Yeah, <laughs> give us that one more time. <laughs> perfect, perfect. Because I like, I rack the focus. And so then you'll just do that. <laughs> and then we'll go into it. Transition. I'm you're using like the word perfect. Right no. Fine. All right, if y'all aren't dizzy yet, you're about to be. Never mind, plan D or E, I don't even know where waka, we're waka, at. Waka, waka, waka. Remix. We're gonna cook them the cast iron scale right here in Wesson's place. This is this welcome to field trips, y'all. We're field tripping right now. We don't know what we're doing. But I think we're gonna eat dinner yeah, at some point. What's my name? <laughs> Who am I? So we got the pancake batter. We got the rock bass. We got the egg. And we got the fish fry. 
y'all are crazy. All right, here's a tip. Oh, you Always just gonna quit so freeze easy. season Keep your watching. fillets, your monster fillets. Oh, you've been to Australia, okay. huh? Okay. Like yep. Because oh, no. if you try to season your batter, you're just gonna waste a whole lot of seasoning. Yep. So here we go. Egg wash. Hold on, you guys want to know a little fun hack to make sure that oil's ready? I know. All right. What does she know? You take the dry mix and you put it in there and if it goes, it's ready. Wait, how is that again? It's ready. <laughs> <laughs> you want to test it? Well, you nailed that both times. That was the perfect. It's ready. Wow. Not quite. It, no, it did it. Well, yeah. let's, let's do it again. We sizzling. It wasn't as dramatic as Courtney was, but pretty yeah. close. That's, it's ready. I like it. All right. There we go. Then so egg wash, yeah. Louisiana fish fry. Yep, good, good. Decent coverage. You don't want a whole lot of excess or like when your oil is uh, being used again three years from now. It's going to look really disgusting. And always lay out yeah. towards you. Don't that's, lay towards, yeah. That's not, I mean, that, I thought that was a given. No, not always. You, you, you'd be surprised by the amount of people that get third degree burns by laying towards them. Towards and that's what you're looking for. If it's not yeah. bubbling aggressively, your oil's not hot enough. That's perfect. Influencers in the wild, right? We got two cameras on the most like, oh, oh, oh no. Influencers wilding out. What just happened? Hey, one grease fire tonight, that feels like a win. Really, only one grease fire only so one. far? Oh, and I mean, put itself out. Yeah, that was, a, that was a, a super minor emergency. Do we have a uh, utensil to remove these? Yeah, we're gonna need it because these are not gonna take more than a minute or two, I feel like. You want some color on it? A little golden brown? Man, that looks okay. good, dude. So, Courtney, you wanna be an epic uh, okay. sous chef and hold the plate? I'll be, oh, oh my god, I'm like the Vanna White of... This is right this way. Wow, that's really Vanna good. White that's really good. Some of that. <laughs> What's that? Some um, yeah, it's a little bit much, but I think it'll be okay. We're basically gonna drain some with every, yeah, with every piece that comes out. I think it'll be all right. Yeah. Smell like my uncle Tom's house in here, which I love. That's great. This is uh, Jemima and Sam. Fever. Oh, this you is a pancake, huh? Also, another little hack, if you don't have beer, or if you do not want to use beer, you can use anything that has any type of carbonation. Let's try Ooh, look at that one. Down <laughs> oh, oh dude. Easy splasher. Easy free will. So you're really looking for this charred black color in your face? Yeah. Oh my god. That's, uh, that is perfect. <laughs> that's a piece of charcoal. Um, <laughs> Life hack, how to make charcoal with rock bass. Now I'm part of this. Would you like Perfectly you executed. Right? <laughs> Dude, you're killing it right now. Too late. Gordon, you're killing your job. I've been we preparing were... my whole life to be the Vanna White of rock bass. Of rock bass? What are those? I don't know. Well, I feel like Vanna White would have higher standards than this. I'm not going to lie. I'm not going to lie. You know what? You work with what you got. That's true. That's is... true. You're really it. looking for that dark brown slash blackish color. Oh, we ruined it. Oh, we gotta go catch more raw bass, bro. <laughs> this is this you is that all that right there. Bust out the V9 spinner, <laughs> If that ain't a thumbnail, <laughs> blackened. It's blackened. Blackened. The engagement will be at least thirty percent better because of that. I don't think I use guys really serious right now. Yeah. Yeah, this is as serious as it gets. How, how do you feel about what you're holding? How's that look? I mean, considering that this is going to be my first time experiencing eating bass. Ideal. I think it's going to go up from here. <laughs> Like, you don't want to set the bar too high right away, folks. No, this is like. Oh, yeah. oh, oh he's yeah. ready. He's in. Oh, 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 he's like, no. Oh, wait a minute. He's camera shy. He's camera shy. You want some? I gotta think about it. Super hesitant. He's like, I'll gnaw on those paper towels before I eat yeah, the fish. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you guys. So the first the first batch wasn't perfect, I would say, but the second batch is looking legit. So we got the pancake battered there, fish fry battered there. We got some more pancake battered going down right now. Second time's a charm. We lost some tap. Oh, dude, those are done. No. They're getting there. Well, yeah. God, dude. <laughs>
You're the worst sous chef ever. You are passable for sure. This guy failed the test. Yeah, it's got a little bit different texture. It's a little fluffier. That's why it looks okay. Yeah, and it's just a dip, dip. If you like pancakes on your fish, I mean, it's up to you. Heck yeah, who doesn't? Who right? doesn't? Beast. I'm gonna have this. You guys eat the fish. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> All right. All things considered, it's shaped out to be a pretty good meal. As long as you don't lift those paper towels, it doesn't look so bad. Oof. Oh, look that. that doesn't look bad at all. Just keep passing them down. Thank you. Well, you guys, I wouldn't say that this was perfectly executed, but we're not here for five-star dining. We're here for just good friends, good eats, and good times. And I know at least that top paper towel worth of fish is going to be delicious. The first batch, we messed up the temperature a little bit. It happens. I mean, despite Courtney's sprinkle some fairy dust on it, and if it sizzles, it's perfect trick. We may have, we may have over, overcooked it a little bit. Uh, sriracha. It's gonna be good, you guys. I guarantee it's gonna good. be delicious. Okay, uh, it. Which one? The one that's winking? The fillet? It's definitely not <laughs> winking. So. Oh, somebody. <laughs> she's picking the. She's picking the rarest. Absolutely. I mean, I'll, I'll, I'll eat I like them. Style. You know, like I'll eat them. How I love how like, I like y'all are like saying this shop. is so rare. And... You know, I don't discriminate. Wait, let me see it. To me, if you do you like well done? Medium well. Oh, I got a I need This might not be the one. This might not be the one that wins your heart, but it, this is an important moment because Bree doesn't like fish, and she's going to give it a shot. Wow. So here's to the mighty rock bass and its sacrifice. Cheers, Cheers. to the googly eye. To the googly eye. Bubby wants to try it too. Okay, here mm. we go. Here we go. I'll drop the first one. Mm. Hey, that is you know, pretty good. Honestly. Oh. Yeah. It's really not bad. No, it's got a even being like what we taste. thought was on the overcooked side. <laughs> no, I don't think we thought okay. it, it's on the overcooked <laughs> side. There's I mean, no. I'm not. It's fried. I'm you can not fry my like, sock and it tastes good. I'm not saying no. Okay, let's. Oh. What, do, what do you think? Oh, that's the ultimate test. <laughs> the ultimate test. Yum. <laughs> Look at he looks deep in contemplation. Oh, he likes that. You want more? Oh, Look at him. Okay, so more. next up, we've got um, Jemima and Sam Adams beer battered burnt. Beer battered burnt. Okay. I like so the. We're uh, gonna have to split this up yeah. once again. No, you don't need the. Fork. Yeah, I don't need a whole piece of this. Thing. Yeah, don't, don't hate. I won't hate. I won't hate. I won't. Gotta give it a shot, man. Gotta give it a shot. That's not you bad at all. You guys hate beer battered. It's not. Yeah. Not ideal. I would say. Yeah. Like I said, it works. Well, it was no. The first one in the no. Entire. Right. Quit, quit judging that fish fry based on that, bro. I use that fish fry a lot, and I'll tell you what, it does more than work. It works. When properly executed, which was sure. is on me, and it was look, not I today. Mean, look much better. Yeah. We got better. Yeah. We progressed, and, you know, normally a fish fry, you get a lot. You're 30, 40, 50 pieces, you know. By the time you're done, you got it dialed. Yeah. Oh, I just ate mine. I tried mine. <laughs> <laughs> hey! It was, it was okay. We're doing it? a... We're, it was... We're doing a group... It was edible. We're I doing... ate all of my piece, so... Gosh. Here we go. I'm actually gonna... It was gonna good. It was good. Do a little sriracha now. Courtney over here with no manners. Just... Sorry. Just... I thought we were all on the same page there. I like I just... his style. A little sriracha Okay, a little... Yeah. I just happened to... A little, little darker yeah. than... Yeah. Than ideal. But I think it's gonna Holy. be good. Oh, whoa, whoa. Gotcha. Hey. I'm excited about this. Oh, what do you got? What are you dipping in? Uh, yeah. Sriracha, sriracha mayo. mayo. Sriracha mayo. Here you go. Sriracha mayo. No, I want to. I want to taste. Goes, I got sriracha. You goes. You got your mayo? And I said, How about sriracha mayo? Ooh. Ooh. So I think it's perfect. I want to taste raw bass mayo. the way the way God made it. <laughs> and pancake batter. Fine. Good. Pancake batter and overcooked. Uh, it's still good. Honestly, it's still good, and I can tell that if the yeah. oil hadn't been so hot, it would be amazing. I'm excited to try the white bass that we cooked appropriately. <laughs> this is a little bit of, a little, little bit, you know. He'd be remiss if he said it was good. Dad would say, charcoal cleans your teeth, boy. Nah. That's what Pops always said. That's not, Pops never said, I don't know why I just said that. Try My father never said that once. Charcoal <laughs> cleans your teeth, why did I just say that? It does, though. I don't know it's where that is. charcoal yeah. uh, toothpaste. Yeah. Mm. True. Almost bought some. Exactly. Hey Bush, you, you getting like desperate like for pro staffers? Really? <laughs> Your beer's not nearly as bad as I thought it would be. Yeah, I'll tell you what, I got on. <laughs> and everyone here in Missouri is offered it too. Bless you. Which, like, had a which is where Shelly. That's good. Go. Mm -hmm. Is that good, bud? 
the one that what? got away. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You already had a piece. Of it. You already had a piece. Yeah, go ahead. Oliver, did you get that? Not yet. You want to cut yeah, one, man. like half one? Sure. You want to just like so meet in the middle? Someone doesn't eat it. fish. Deal. She's eating fish. I, I know. I <laughs> have more than one no? bite. No? Whoa. It looks like someone is enjoying. Come on, bro. It's 2020. We can't meet in the middle of a piece of fish. Okay. You want like a little cheers? I'm gonna yeah. say that that's toast. Pancake battered wine beer batter. Your batter. Mm. Brie, rave reviews. Yeah. From Bree and uh, Brooks I think my over here. Your batter's better. <laughs> your batter. Yeah. All right. So you guys gonna share some with me or what? Oh, oh here. You're oh, not no. giving me. No, Maddie. Right here. Right here. Whole piece. Take. Party's <laughs> all full, like bro. Good, I'm done. Dude. No, it is. It is good. That's delicious. Again. And you and you get the the beer taste. Right. You which guys. Which is good. Mm hmm. That's what's cool is you can use a beer that you like if you want to like. Have that flavor. I want to see like yeah. using like a Mexican beer, like a Pacifico or a Modelo. Wait, how'd you say that? A Pacifico. Wow. Pacifico. <laughs> My friend. You guys. Friend. Pancake batter. La Puente Holmes. On your fish. Uh, Y'all thought I was crazy. That, that's, that's, that's where I'm gonna remember that trick. That's good. It's yeah, easy. Okay, can somebody get a camera on this poor piece of fish? Right? I don't know, but look oh, at him. He's, he's oh, he's man, like we got. And like, he likes we got the last. The last kid picked at recess he right here. <laughs> that's Just like me on the basketball court my whole life. <laughs> yeah, especially oh. when Weston's playing. From what I hear. Oh. 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 I've seen it. I bet. I bet a lot of money. And by money, I mean hey, nothing catch, but catch my reputation. It's on Oliver match, winning the basketball one-on-one no, -on -one cool. challenge, I was wrong. I, I wasn't no. smacked him. I heard. Hey, look, I wasn't there. I was there. I was working. I'm I was actually witnessing. And I'm gonna look like, like a superstar. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was like, nobody's like, yo, I'm taking West. I'm taking West. They're like, okay, star, like, dude. Yeah. All right, y'all. Wow. Well, hope you enjoyed this unconventional catch and cook. The only kind of catch and cooks I I do. This was the most disorganized but delicious. Catch and cook I've done in a, in a while, in a long while. Turned out amazing. Hope you enjoyed it. Be sure to subscribe. Oliver, Weston, Maddie here. They've all got YouTube channels. Check them out. Courtney's also got a banging Instagram account. Check her out. Put a link down in the description. Thanks for coming along. It was a blast. I like Missouri. Good people around here. Good times. It's so a show me state. Mighty rock bass. Mighty rock bass. You've like expanded my horizons. Because I know as I head north, I'm going to catch more rock bass. Oh. You better believe. Giant. I ain't going back. Giant googly eyes. I ain't going back. I'm not going to lie. I think that the googly eyes were better than the... The googly eyes. Hey, I'm telling you, we go on a trip just in Target. And they were burnt. They were burnt. No, it's good. That's not good. Just a step below crappie. Like, just a... I'd, I'd yeah, love I think it was a better tasting fish to me. I mean, there's times you come out and you just hit the stringer. Like.